good morning today I'm gonna show you how to make a coffee gagayin ko lang ang aking kailida na si Noel Bitorensky yun nga I have this fun fact charot I don't drink coffee in the afternoon Kasi yung utak ko sinasabi, hindi na ako makakatulog. Ha-ha! <laughs> Ang laro niya, isaksak ang coffee maker. At sunod na ilabas ang pot nito. <laughs> At ang mga kaakibat na materialis. O diba? Coffee and tea. Kasi so, ayaw mo yan karoon. one-man-team tayo. Tapos, shimbri. Kahit pa may built-in, built-in <laughs> filter na siya, gumagamit pa rin ako ng medium size, I don't know, this is a small size shajang coffee filter ilagay ng matiwasay here. Ayan. Ayan na yan. Sige, ayusin ko yan mamaya ha. Teka lang. At syempre, hindi magpapahuli ang ating kape na paubos na. Ang ating coffee grounds. Grabe, isang timplahan na lang to. So, I got this from Starbucks. Hanggang ngayon, hindi pa ako nakakabalik. <laughs> Tatanong ko sa akin lang ako ng flavor to. <laughs> Basta sabi nila sa akin, vintage daw to. And they gave it to me for free when I attended their coffee seminar dun sa Robinson's Metro East. And hello to Sean na nag-invite sa akin. <laughs> so I got this for free and I'm so happy because it's so good. Basta ang alam ko lang medium roast to. From the lesson that I learned sa lasa niya is medium roast and... Yeah, it's so good. It's kind of acidic because nasa gilid ang kanyang taste. So there, let's put it in. Dajang magic, ayan na siya. Nilagay ko na siya dyan. And we are to put this over the top. Okay, let's put water in. So, for me, nandun ang kakaunti ang aking shoe big. Meron naman tayong guide dito. Siya! And I stop right there because it's good for one cup. Para tamang-tama sa aking lasa. Let's turn it on. And we wait. Oh, yeah. Umaga! Kita-kita pala ito in perfections. But yeah, I'm a human. And hello, hello. So, ito na. Magkakapi na nga po tayo. So, since coffee is acidic, I don't usually I'll drink it with an empty stomach kasi mas lalala lang yung acidity natin. Mga kapuso, kapamilya, kapatid. So, that's why. Ginagawa ko muna, of course, it's either I drink 
cup of water and I eat breakfast. But I think for me, a cup of water is enough. Basta hindi empty stomach. Kasi it'll make our acidity worsen. Yon. So, ito na siya. So, this one, I let it sit for a few more minutes before I take more of before I take the coffee kasi nga, para ma-filter out pa siya more. Kasi baka may mga natitirang droplets of coffee. Yes, precious! Pero yun, so ngayon, okay na siya. And what I learned dun sa sa seminar, pa-seminar, pa-free coffee seminar ni Starbucks. There are four ways to drink your coffee. Ho, oh, ho! Oh. <laughs> There are four steps pala. Hindi way, sorry. There are four steps to drink your coffee. And, this is how we do it. I'm gonna show it to you. Parang kompleto srikados na tong ating video, di ba? How to make coffee and how to drink coffee, you guys. Ayan. First step. You smell. Smell. Smell it, smell it, my friend. Savor the smell. Sabi nga ni Jolie sa friends. You don't smell my sandwich. You take the taste. Pero yun na nga. Going back sa kape natin. Sorry, I'm a friend's fan. Like, super. You smell it. Ang bango grabe. And then, ano nga ba yun? alala ko na. Nag-shout ginugil ko. <laughs> Pero alam, alam niyo yun, alala ko yung moment na tinuro, tinuro to sa akin. So sabi nga sa Google, in base of a training that I can remember now, <laughs> seminar. So when you smell the coffee, it has a subtle, you know, effect on our taste. So yan. Sabi nila, pag inamoy mo daw, sabihin mo din kung ano yung aamoy mo. And then, I smell the roasted beans. Oh! <laughs> Pero nga, I smell the roasted beans. O, oh, diba? At medyo may tamis siya ng konti sa smell. And then, second step is you slurp it. You know how the Japanese eat noodles? It's the same way though with our coffee. Para hindi tayo mapaso. Hindi, but at the same, when we slurp, once we slurp, ano yan. So, dali natin may inom ng kape. Try natin. Aha. Aha, aha. We slurp it. Oh, yeah. Third step is to locate. Actually, it's the first time that I've heard about it when I attended the training is to locate the taste. So, saan, kumbaga, saan maglalanding yung lasa ng kape? Because that describes what kind of coffee it is. Diba? So, ito, so next time na yung, or you can ask my friend from Starbucks, Sean. Yes! Feeling <laughs> close. Hi, Sean. <laughs> Kung ano-ano yung mga uh, taste and kinds of coffee. So, every time I drink this coffee, look at it natin na. Ayan, ito, medyo lumalan din siya sa likod ng taong ko. Like, sabi kasi niya, sabi sa akin from what I can remember, if it's in the side of your tongue, it's acidic. Oh, baka nagkamali ako. Correct me if I'm wrong. But then, this coffee landed at the back or middle part of my tongue. So, yan. Yeah, that's the third step in drinking your coffee or tasting your coffee. Diba? Is locate. So, first, smell. Second, slurp. Third, is locate. And the last one, describe. For me, the last one, Describe and enjoy, o, diba? <laughs> Describe. It's good. <laughs> it has a bitter taste. Medyo bitter, 
yeah, bitter siya, more than fruity or may asin, konti lang asin niya. And that's it for today. This is my simple vlog. Ha! Coffee vlog. Hello to my coffee lovers, friends there. So, comment nyo naman kung ano mga tips nyo in your coffee. And, what's your go-to coffee grounds? Because, I have to restock. Ubus na. Anyway, thank you for watching. I have a page pala. It's Teacher Cowl. Like, and subscribe, and share. Have a good day, everyone. Stay safe, stay home.